We're a few months out from the launch of Google's next generation Pixel phones, but already some of the first details are starting to leak, painting a very interesting picture of at least two new Pixel handsets for 2017. I'm Alex with Android Central, and it's time for a roundup of what we know so far about the next Google Pixel phones. So let's start with the basics. Same as last year, it looks like we're getting two phones from Google in 2017, but this time there are two different manufacturers. There'll be a smaller Pixel made by HTC and a larger one manufactured by LG. Originally there was supposed to be a larger HTC built Pixel as well, but supposedly that's been discontinued in favour of just one premium big screen Pixel, and that's the one made by LG. Right now there's kind of a mishmash of information out there around Walleye, that's the smaller HTC Pixel, and Timon, that's the codename for the LG made Pixel XL. Based on leaked specs from benchmarking sites, it's looking likely that both will run a Snapdragon 835 processor with at least 4 gigs of RAM. For the smaller HTC Pixel, reports from XDA and Android Police point to it retaining a very similar size, around 5 inches, with similar bezels and a similar 1080p resolution. Though hopefully with a bit more roomy 64 gigs of base storage this time. For the more premium LG made Pixel XL, the specs line up with many of the rumours we've been hearing around the LG V30. A 6 inch 18x9 2K OLED display and a refreshed design, as well as up to 128 gigs of storage according to one report. And if these rumours are to be believed, then it's going to be the LG Pixel that's the one to get excited about this year, with the HTC model seeming like more of an afterthought. No live photos of either Pixel phone have leaked out yet, but the best information we have to go on comes from this one render produced in-house by Android Police based on information that they've seen. So there are a lot of similarities with last year's Pixel phones here, including that trademark scratch-prone glass section on the back there, though the fingerprint scanner has been moved to the lower metal section now. The bezels have been cut down considerably, and it looks like the glass front has a pronounced curve to it, though the display itself does appear to be flat. Other Pixel XL holdovers include flat sidewalls, slightly curved edges around the back, there's also some LG G6 DNA in there and the way the panel is arranged around the front. AP also reports, and this is something we've been hearing from our own sources, that Google is looking at including an edge sense-like squeezable function into at least the larger 2017 Pixel. It's not clear exactly what this would do though. One obvious possibility is that it could activate Google Assistant, or perhaps it might be programmable like it is on the HTC U11. And finally the camera, from this render we can see that there's just one rear shooter on the larger Pixel, presumably that will also be true of the smaller Pixel. No camera bump this time it seems, but uh, the opening does look a little larger than last year. No odd on camera specs, but likely upgrades over the old Pixel camera should include a brighter lens, maybe OIS, better HDR plus capabilities thanks to that faster processor. And of course there will be some mysteries on the software side as well, we're looking at Android 8 or maybe 8.1 out of the box, possibly with some new software tricks from Google. So that's about all we know so far, kind of a fragmented picture still, but stay tuned to AndroidCentral.com for more Pixel leaks and analysis in the weeks ahead, and subscribe to us here on YouTube so you don't miss new Android opinions and reviews as they land. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.